Well, K-State is trading the Little Apple for the big one this week when the men's basketball team plays in the Sweet 16 in New York City on Thursday. The school's success both in basketball and football has put it in the national spotlight over the last year. Kate's Jackson Overstreet is here now with how the school is trying to capitalize on that. Jackson? You know, the more times that the men's basketball team plays on national TV, the more eyes it has on it. And from there, the school's admission department is hoping to use that uh, excitement to bring more people to Manhattan. The Kansas State men's basketball team is still dancing in the NCAA tournament. And the team's success is being felt off the court in Manhattan. We're hoping that we get on people's radar that maybe have never even considered or heard of K-State. Karen Goose with the school's admission department says K-State has seen a bump in applications this year. She says it isn't all due to the success of the school's basketball and football teams, but that does help a lot. Having a team on the stage like the Sweet 16 helps her and her staff start a lot of conversations. It does allow us to talk about uh, you know, the academic programs that are available that they may not know we offer. So just how real is the potential bump from a team's run in the NCAA tournament? Just ask Wichita State. I would say that the March Madness really brings a bonanza of free public relations opportunities for colleges. Director of Admissions Bobby Gandu says the school is still feeling the positive effects of the Shockers' run to the Final Four 10 years ago. That we've had some significant enrollment growth. We used to have uh, a small number of students coming to us from out of state. Now, very regularly, you know, we'll have more than 120 new students from Texas or more than 120 from Oklahoma and Missouri. Because of that, Goose says the longer the Cats keep winning, <laughs> the busier her department expects to be with new potential students. There is a lot of exciting things going on in Manhattan, um, and so this is the ability to, to put a spotlight on some of the great people and fantastic work that's happening. Now, Goose says with K-State having a new president and launching several new initiatives and scholarships this year, she thinks the school is well positioned to take advantage of all this free media exposure. In Studio Jackson Overstreet, Cake News on your side.